Companies are investing in cutting-edge digital technologies now than ever before to boost productivity and remain competitive. Artificial intelligence technologies can power firms to improve their efficiency through process automation and to use customer insights to cater to a wide variety of customers. However, recent AI technologies such as ChatGPT have revived fears of a bleak economic outlook for many. While such fast-evolving technologies can eliminate some jobs, they can also complement other jobs, improving worker productivity and earnings. As such, there is a high degree of uncertainty regarding how these new technologies are going to shape worker composition and what that might mean for worker pay. Our research will investigate how digital technology adoption impacts firms' employment, productivity and profitability, as well as worker outcomes, such as worker pay, in Canada. To answer these questions, ideally, we would want to exogenously vary the level of digital technologies across firms to compare outcomes of interest. However, digital technology adoption does not vary independently of firm size and workforce composition. More productive firms that are able to attract better paid workers who are more productive are also more likely to adopt digital technologies. We propose to circumvent this identification problem by focusing on foreign multinational firms operating in Canada. Multinational enterprises have business operations in different countries. Their decision to adopt digital technologies does not depend on the business conditions in a particular location. Instead, they adopt a common technology policy across all firms in all locations. As such, their decision to upgrade digitally should, in principle, be independent of local firm dynamics and labor market conditions. So, we will instrument for the technology adoption of U.S. multinational firms operating in Canada with that of their headquarters to understand how digitalization determines outcomes for firms and workers. Our results will shed light upon the future of work in a world that is increasingly dominated by digital technologies. The highlight of our research is Aberdeen Data's granular technology measures at the business establishment level. AI requires huge amounts of data to be processed in real time. As firms increasingly employ AI, they will require greater data storage capacity. Hence, we will focus on data storage as our measure of digital technology. We will be the first to use direct measures of multinationals' digital storage upgrading to estimate the impact on Canadian workers' employment and pay. Information on workers' post-secondary education available through StatCan's seed data will enable quantifying how multinationals' decision to upgrade affects workers with different educational backgrounds and specializations. To learn more about our exciting research, please join 4.0's webinar on March 9. Thank you.